Yes, hello from us. Welcome back for our chemistry class. This is the fifth lesson under uh, rates of reactions. We are dealing with the effect of change in concentration on reaction rates. Last time we did an experiment and we collected some data. So today our objective is also to investigate. I'm going to show you how to fill that table how to draw the graph, and then later you have some questions to answer based on that graph. So the objective is still the same, to investigate the effect of concentration on the reaction rates. Now, that is our table, and we are going to fill it. That is the duty that we are going to do here. So if you look at the first column, we have the beaker, beaker A, B, C, D, E. And then we have the volume of sodium thiosulfate. The volume of sodium thiosulfate in Bika A was 10, Bika B was 20, Bika C was 30, Bika D was 40, and Bika E was 50. Look who you switch. Ah, yes, how? 